what's going on everybody welcome back to a new video and today we are playing on the free to play account and it's been such a long time after thinking for a while how can i progress in this difficult time of gym league so i finally decided on some new goals the following goals i'm going to list are in no order so maybe like one day i'll try to do one goal or another day i'll try to do another one with the addition of clans we now have a reward and boost that can help me the boost we receive from clans is a 2.5 times muscle boost which is massive but more importantly now we have the mega shield as a reward the mega shield is a free gear and is quite powerful the mega shield gives you a muscle boost of 3.8 times a pump of 150 percent and training speed 120 percent the only issue is in order to get it we do need 100k clan points but with how strong my clan is we will get it sooner than later the next goal and in my opinion one of the hardest things you could get in gym league is shiny emperor horns with the emperor horns we will get a 4.2 times muscle boost stamina regen 200 percent and a cash boost of 50 percent now the cash boost is also a big one for me as well. Now I estimate the shiny emperor horns will cost me about roughly $3 billion or maybe even more. And for the last goal is the divine weights. The divine weights will not only triple the muscle boost we gain but will be the key to completing the prison gym. In order for us to get the divine weights we have to earn it through the mini games. So eventually I will get it because I do mini games and gym competitions every day. So I'd say with these goals we have a strong case of reaching the next gym and more. So the progress you see from here on now has been in the making for weeks so for the most part i'm going to try to get emperor horns but if i feel like it's taking way too long i'm gonna wait until i max out the golem body altar now before i actually begin i need to give the game pass to the last giveaway winner which they have the option of getting either galaxy weights or muscle man and they opted for muscle man this time now if you are interested in these giveaways you can join my discord the link will be in the description below and now finally we can begin the free to play series and also don't forget to like the video because i am about to throw 10 plus hours a day because the grind is going to be insane before i start doing something i need to do my daily quest because i need to help my clan hit that 100k mark one of the goals i have is the mega shield so we need to help our clan gain all these points as soon as possible but they're very good players so they don't need me that much i think the plan right now is to try to get emperor horns but it's going to be pretty difficult i'm not gonna lie i trolled a little bit i did not get the emperor horns when the unlimited premium gear crate glitch was out so now i'm going to spend 500 million dollars a day to get one and let me be honest i see myself spending over three billion dollars easily but worst case scenario if i spend like two billion dollars i will try to wait until i unlock the golem body altar and get it to like 50 percent because right now making money is difficult but getting shiny emperor horns would be pretty nice early on all right so the first batch is done so let's now see what we get and i highly doubt i even got one mythical because the luck on the basic gear crate is pretty terrible but we have 1665 gear so let's check that out you know what i've been thinking about what if i farm gears until all common gears hit 99 so when i have 99 of each common gear the game will stop giving me them maybe one of these days i'll check that out but as you can see we got no mythical item so what i'm going to do right now is just trade what we got left over because we still have a second chance to get mythical gears in the trade-ups the only good thing i could think of besides maybe getting a mythical gear from trade-ups is to get the hero cape or crown because not only are they super cold they give you a lot of money boost so i can use both of them until i get the shiny emperor horns because the shiny emperor horns also give you a 50% cash boost which I think is the most in the game. I'm gonna be honest this is the most painful thing ever because yeah I'm happy we have a second chance of getting a mythical gear but our chances right now are still very low. So now let's trade up the legendary gears and hopefully we get lucky and oh we got a hero cape let's go. All right we got one more chance left and I'm not sure why I just kicked us out but we got another hero cape yo. Nah you see I'm happy we got the first one but come on bro not a second one. I'm not really sure which one to use with the hero cape but I'm pretty Pretty sure i've done the math before and my blue scarf is better than the metal right now if it was a gold medal then yeah i'd use it so i guess for now we would just use the blue scarf and hero cape and whenever we get the crown we will replace the scarf with that guys 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 the clan just hit 100 000 total league points and you know what that means we just have unlocked a new mega shield the mega shield will not only give us the greatest chance of reaching the divine gym but also complete these body altars in a good fashion look at that mega shield the muscle boost alone is broken at 3.8 times for a free to play player everything else is a bonus i can't wait to combine this with the shiny emperor horns so with the first unlock of the series i feel like if we unlocked either divine weights or shiny emperor horns we could start working now but i'm pretty sure the divine weights are easier to get because emperor horns are super rare the divine weights are also rare but two percent sounds better than 0.002 percent i'm just so hyped to use it because not only does it look really cool but the boosts are quite powerful i do have the shiny shark blade and 
it was nerfed and buffed in the past. So it went from 3.6 to 2.25 all the way back up to 3.2. So if the shiny strike blade was 3.6 and I got the divine weights, I'd be way more comfy, but it is what it is. I'm about to max out my chest and I think this is the first time in three weeks I actually worked out. Because before it was impossible, but testing out the mega shield, we have hope. Right now, I'm not using all the power-ups, but when I get all the power-ups and divine weights, oh boy, we will see some massive progress. This actually makes me excited to play gym league again, I'm not gonna lie. I probably have way more fun on my free-to-play account than my main account. So maybe in a few more days, I'll give shiny upper horns a few more tries, and if not, we will start with what we got. I'm not sure, should I farm back up to $1 billion and then try again, or should I just use $500 million as another attempt to get emperor horns? Yeah, I think I'm gonna go farm money because I think soon we will have the lucky weekend, and when that happens, I do not want to be low on money. I kind of want to see how good crystal shoulders are, and no way, no way we got divine weights. Yo, how did I not notice that? Bro, you guys don't understand how big of a difference this does for free-to-play players. Like now, I can lift weights and finish the bars in golem body altar. Actually, wait, the golem body altar still might be a little bit tough, but I think now we have a good chance of completing golem. So with the divine weights being secured, we have two out of the three goals so far unlocked. And the final goal being the shiny upper horns, I'm not really surprised, it's pretty difficult to get. But divine weights was a huge one because we are literally tripling our total power. And on top of that, we also have the 2.5 times clan boost. I guess also on the weekends, we do have that extra 1.5 times boost. So yeah, that's another one. So we farm money well above $1 billion. And also we are going to use the crystal shoulders because it does give us a 25% luck boost. Now, even though that sounds like a low amount, it's still something. I think even if we don't get the emperor horns today, the weekend will be our greatest chance. And since the weekend is a lucky weekend for gears and poses, I might save up over $700 million and just go crazy. So now we got 1,236 gears and I honestly have no faith because this is like the third or fourth time I have over 1k gears and don't even get a single mythical gear at all. So yeah, of course, no mythical gears, but ironically, we got five shark blades. It's kind of funny because I used to struggle to even get one shark blade, but now since we make so much more money, we get the shark blade like nothing. But now for a second chance at a mythical gear, we need to trade up all the gears we have now. Once again, no faith. I highly doubt I'll get anything and oh, I got a cursed wings. Not bad, not bad. But I doubt I'll ever use them. But I think next time I do this, I'm going to farm 3k gears instead of 1k. Because I think if I max out the common gears, the game will prevent me from getting them. And since I can't get them, they'll just roll over to the next one. So maybe if I don't get a common gear, it might give me a mythical one by accident. You never know. Yeah, I think I have spent so far $2 billion roughly, which is a lot of money. I think I'm going to try one more time and it will be on the lucky weekend. I will use my crystal shoulders to help a little bit, but if I don't get any mythical items by Sunday night, I'm just going to start working out. I don't think I need emperor horns until I hit the divine gym. So when I max out the golem body altar, I will try it again before moving on. But yeah, that's all I got for today. This episode was about three weeks in the making and I'm glad I just returned to the free to play account. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.